Hello hello, it's Revy here and in today's video I'll be showing you guys how to use Rotobrush in After Effects. So when you have made your project, you're gonna add your footage in. And if footage I'm using is uh, Lucky's music video, double check. And as you can see, the, uh, it has some black bars here, so I'm just gonna fix that by scaling up. Just like that. I'm just gonna pre-comp this. Okay, so now you're ready to rotor brush and you're gonna click here on the rotor brush tool then double click on the layer and you're gonna mark whatever you want to mask out essentially if this happens to you the frame rate uh, mismatch or footage we feel found blah, 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 blah. you're just gonna go into composition composition settings and then change it to whatever it says here which is 24 in this case bam we are just gonna continue to rotor brush this and if you want to delete, like we don't, we don't, we don't want to have like this wall uh, here. Okay, so you're gonna hold all, and then the the line here becomes red. And then you bam, you get rid of it. So something like this. So we are just gonna press play, just like that. That is. Pretty decent in my opinion. Okay, it's not good, but like you guys get the point. Let's say we're done. You're going to press freeze then, and then it's going to freeze all the frames so you can't edit them anymore unless you unfreeze afterwards. Bam, just like that. And here we can press this thing here toggle alpha boundary so you just can see what they've masked out and here you can uh, change some uh, settings here uh, you can feather it out but that looks kind of weird in my opinion. We're gonna keep it at five and contrast you can change. But I think this looks good in my opinion. So yeah, we're just gonna go back to our main composition. Okay, so if you just watched the tutorial to know how to rotor brush, it's basically done now. So you can <laughs> click off if you don't want to see the bonus animation you can do with the rotor brush right now. Okay, so the whole mask here is not the best. <laughs> but like, I like this mask here. It's pretty okay. Start like from there maybe. Bam. And now when you have this mask here, you can add essentially whatever you want to the background. So for example, if we make it text, and then you can take, drag this down underneath. I think this looks pretty cool. And if we wanna make this like insanely nice, you can just add maybe half tone, bam, 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 yellow again, something like that. Deep load to this. Then half tone to this again, then yellow again in the beginning you could be like transform it could be let's put lucky over here in the beginning something like that bam and then for the last position here so yeah something like that and then motion blur as always also fix the text here the star could be up here and then go down here so we get some sort of movement here and if you want to make it flow a little bit you could just bam and then fix the speed graph and now you're gonna duplicate the text layer okay so now when we duplicate the text layers move the new layer one frame behind the text layer above now on the new text layer change the new text so it has a yellow stroke on it now just duplicate the text layer with a stroke and go one frame behind the layer above. Just like that, I think I'm done now. Looks pretty good in my opinion. Okay, so this is how you wrote the brush and uh, made a easy but simple animation in After Effects. And yeah, hope you guys enjoyed the video and I see you guys next time. Bye bye.